Hey everybody, this is Coimpact with a brand new Let's Play. A game that is not dissimilar to something we've Let's Played before, but it's not exactly the same thing that we Let's Played before either. And hopefully I've adjusted the volume because it was loud last time. Oh boy, was it loud. I also couldn't run this in full screen. It just wouldn't work. Hi, Steam Pop-Up. Memoria Entertainment. I don't think that's Memoria. That's not an M. That's definitely a, an N. I, I think. Here is our main menu. The game called Onit. Or Onight. There's a lot of ways to pronounce it. I've beaten this game before. Uh, so the lore library does have all, so dancing, all 25... Yes, we'll we'll meet the the husto uh, the hustomte, uh as we get into the game. I'm pretty sure that's not how that's pronounced, but uh, I'm I, I'm not from the Netherlands, Danish, maybe some of Germany. It's it's in that area. Who doesn't actually know? I don't want to be offensive. Point is, Knit is a game that we will be getting into. It's a very yeah, see. The guard stumped. Guard stumped. Uh, we'll be meeting a lot of uh, people like this. Little uh, fae. They're basically fae. Well, they are fae. They're magical creatures. The soundtrack is really good. The gameplay is interesting, and I feel like since we're doing knit stories, and that's about knits, and this is about knits, we might as well to we double down. The double down is always the answer. Let's start a new game and. Stop hanging around the lore library. We'll Hello. pull around with it at the end. Did you lose the train? I Come, have do have subtitles on, but they're kind of small. Wandering needles alone. You see, this is a special night. One very small. Let me tell you a story to make the hours pass. Ah, yes. Wait until morn. And even fewer believe to be real. I believe it to be real. Why not? Magical fey folk. Let's go. Well, it is just a rock. Not the relevance to the story that I am about to share with you. I'm you sure. Every 100 years or so, a strange event occurs. As the days grow short and the nights long, a night darker than others ensues. The magical darkness will descend upon us from the moon. As darkness envelops the land and the stars awaken. What did Kuja say? It's the night when all the hoofing stuffs come out, right? Appears to be another. It was during a night like this that a small, in the scope of the world, insignificant creature with no name was born. That's us. What is this place? The insignificant creature without a name landed as it emerged from the ground and began to explore the dark world. I love the music in this game. Ah, surprisingly no crash. We did it. We made it into the game. And now we have control. This game is a point and click. Mound of stones. Uh, this is my inventory. It's empty. And down here are the four types of magic. Uh, nature, water, fire, storm, wind, cloud. All right, so nature activated a trail of dirt here. Water turns on the rain. As the small creature explored its surroundings, tiny drops of rain began to fall from the dark sky. I'm hoping that's not too low now. I'll turn it up a bit. All right, have a fire. Nothing on this. And wind? Oh, a dragonfly spawned. Now this game has... It's very dark. I could see how dark it is. It's kind of supposed to be dark, though. 
options. Does this make it any brighter? What is the gamma doing? Nothing? Doesn't look like it made it any brighter on the recording. It's a very dark game. <laughs> Shins. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's making it any brighter. I don't know if I can actually add a, uh, a filter to do this. I shouldn't be doing this on the fly. I can add a Luma key. Is it Luma key that would make it brighter? No. Whoa, no, no, no. That is not brighter. No, no, no. We're, we won't mess with that. I won't mess with that. We're just going to have to deal. Open up that one more time. I'm going to go back to default gamma because it doesn't seem to have done anything. But it's supposed to be a dark and gloomy game, and I'm not really portraying that very well here, am I? And I look at the stone mount. Trying to remember my keys. Ah, there it is. In the middle of the clearing, there was a mound of stone that seemed to have concealed something. Stuck between the stones were two branches tied together to form a cross. Usually a grave. What was I doing below those stones? The creature wondered, standing next to the hole it just crawled out of. Well, if I were to say anything, you were the recently departed. Could you lift the stones? Of course they were. We are quite insignificant, after all. There was a small spring in the clearing, reflecting the night sky. In the middle of the spring, you could see the reflection of a large star. Something about this star seemed different from the others around it. Ah, yes, there is a large star dot there. What a beautiful place! The small, insignificant creature thought to itself admiring the reflected glow of the stars of course oh look an owl stone oh, well that's the go to the owl stone and go to the field we can go either or uh i don't want to go to either of these places just quite yet all right fire activates a comet so it does do something it's in the spring so we got active use observe talk Oh, oh, he just talks to himself. The creature tried to collect some of the cold water, but was unable to keep the elusive liquid in its hands. What hands? I, I don't see any hands on this guy. Look at him. He's all fuzz. Well, I mean, it looks like we got no choice but to go to the field. I mean, it is raining. Let's go to the fields. Make our way to the fields. What the hell is this? Oh, look, Scarecrow. So all these maps do have things you can do with them. Soil much good, and the seeds in the ground had already begun to sprout. Oh, see, now that it's raining, the seeds began to sprout. Activate the nature. We have grown the wheat. The small creature walked across the field. Stalks began to sprout from the wet soil. Amazing. You know, for a small and significant creature, having the power of the four main cardinal elements in the in runes. You know, is really good. The rain had caused a couple of the seeds sown by the farmer to grow rapidly, an occurrence you would only be able to see during a night like this one. It's a very special night that they keep talking about the here. had a strange feeling to it that night, almost as if the stars themselves had come to life trying their hardest to make up for the absence of the moon's glow. Oh, you know what? There, it's a new moon night, I just realized. There are so many of them. The I love the creature's the voice so much. Sky. I wonder how such small things can shine so brightly. I wonder how such small things can shine so brightly. I wonder if I grew that fast when I was born. The small creature pondered. I don't think you were born, though, as a nit, right? You're a nit. The small They're quite a literal one. managed to pick up a handful of oats off the stalks. Ooh, free oats. Hey, we have oats in our inventory now. Let's go activate the scarecrow. See this little button? It means we'll transition. 
Oh, boo! Hi, Scarecrow. Touching the Scarecrow, the creature could feel the dry hay prickling it through the burlap. Ah, I see. In the middle of the field, there stood a rugged Scarecrow, seemingly looking up into the starlit sky. Poor Scarecrow. I do like the little rain effect going on, but I'm out of time, so this has been Coo Impact with Let's Play. Own it! Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. Next time, let's talk to the Scarecrow. I know it sounds crazy, but on a night like this, I think it might work. So I'll see you then.